Hi ho folks, Chris here from the Javelin Tech Team. In this session, we're going to begin to explore the types of dynamic motion we can simulate via dynamic dragging once we begin to apply the advanced and the mechanical mates together. Let's begin by applying a path mate between our link and the path for the conveyor. The path mate may be found within the set of advanced mates that are contained within the mates property manager. We're going to first choose the path to follow by using the Selection Manager. Next, as the component vertex, we'll reach out and select a reference point that I had previously placed within our belt link. We'll follow that first mate up with a second path mate relating the reference point within our belt link back to the conveyor path. Let's zoom out slightly to make sure we can still reference our link component. With the path mates complete, we're going to use the parallel mate to ensure that our link isn't able to twist around the path as it moves along the conveyor. This could also be accomplished by using the pitch, yaw, and roll control within one of our path mate selections earlier. We can now test the link's motion by way of dynamic dragging directly on the link. The next steps here are to use a four positioning only coincident mate to relate the position of the link to the position of the sprocket. The four positioning only option is located at the bottom of the mate property manager. Once that's checked off, I'll go ahead and use a point along the path that I have available and the center of one of my link's holes. The finishing touch will be the application of a rack and pinion mate to ensure that the link moves along the path and drives the sprocket at the appropriate ratio. The unexpected portion of this combination comes when we realize that the rack and pinion mate will not only travel along a straight line, but it will continue to drive the sprocket as the link follows the conveyor path, changing its orientation as it follows each entity around the conveyor loop. I do hope these few mate-related tips have been helpful, and we'll see you again here next time on the Javelin Blog.